Hello and welcome. My name is Chris from ChristopherHole.com and welcome to this next series of videos where we're going to be looking at the three main causes of low back pain. Now they are very uh, general causes. Um, there is a lot more to it than what you're going to find in this video, but as a general overview, we're going to look at the three main causes of uh, low back pain. And in this first video, we are going to be looking at um, the sedentary uh, lifestyle that is so prominent uh, these days uh, and what it's doing is it's causing a lot of people to be sat still for um, long periods of time and that static posture is um, is causing the tissues of of the back um, and of the core to become fatigued and then um, be more vulnerable to uh, to injury in those in those areas and as you can see on the picture here you've got the sort of the dark red areas which is where the pain tends to express itself in the lower back or in and around um, the upper back and the neck so this is where all the tightness begins to happen because of the uh, the tissue fatigue and the reason the tissue fatigue there which is basically um, uh, muscle fatigue uh, comes from um, or in part being in what's called this triple flexed position so what we've got is we've got a flexed knee we've got a flexed hip and we've got a flexed neck so all of this uh, what's known as the triple flexed position is causing excess pressure on the different joints of the body so then when um, it comes to moving around in life and lifting up boxes and um, picking up children and things like that it leaves the body more vulnerable to fatigue uh, sorry to injury so one of the main uh, solutions to this is to begin to move more and that doesn't mean doing exercise if you are in a sedentary job it's it's being able to to sort of number one change position in your seat a lot of people think when they need to uh, be uh, in a good sitting posture they need to be bolt upright with a neutral back but again because you're sat down in a stationary position your body doesn't like to be stationary so by sitting up straight in a static position is just as bad as being slouched in a static position so in the seat if you can every sort of 10 to 15 minutes change your posture sit back sit forward sit on one arm or sit towards one arm sit towards the other arm what this will do this will relieve pressure on those areas of the body and make them uh, a little bit less um, open to fatigue and then open to um, injury and it's exactly the same if you're standing for long periods of time so if you're standing for long periods of time in a static posture the same thing can happen so again it's it's all about uh, changing the, your position when you're stood up in a static position so distribute your weight through both legs for a period of time then go on to one leg then go on to the other leg step forward step back step to the side if you get the chance sat down and stood up try and move around so if you're sat down try and get up walk around the the office or whatever sit back down again if your job allows that but where you can try and keep some degree of movement in your uh, workplace and that will start to loosen the tissues that will start to relieve some of the pain that's there and you will experience in a way less low back pain okay many thanks um, i will speak to you in video number two